I'll be talking to a man who needs little or no introduction at all. The greatest of all time marathoners, Eliud Kipchoge. Karibu Sana, welcome to K24. How are you doing this evening? Thank you, I'm doing well. Uh, all is well here in Eldred and yeah, it's about this pandemic of uh, COVID-19 and that's why I'm at home at this, uh, this Friday. I normally uh -huh. uh, be in the camp, but it's because of uh, coronavirus. And, it yes. has been eight months without action uh, from the world marathon record holder. You know, out of 13 marathons, you have won 12. Uh, you are the only man who has run a sub uh, two hour marathon. You know, how is it like without uh, the athletic action for you? Oh, it's really unfortunate and, uh, you know, I'm running because of passion at the same time, running to inspire many people. So it's, uh, it's hard, so it, it's, it's breaking uh, most of the uh, 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 young guys' uh, hearts because people have trained very well mm -hmm. in high and uh, uh, quality fields uh, uh, and, you know, to be, for a race to be cancelled, mm -hmm. it, 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 it takes a lot. and both mentally and physically. Mm -hmm. And how is life like right now, staying home seven days as opposed to, you know, you guys used to go to camp five days and come back home just two days. How is life like staying home all this time? <laughs> uh, life has changed. Mm -hmm. You know, this, the, this is the, the, the time, this is the man where I, uh, I used to be in training most of the early, most of the sorry. Used to be in training, but now it's, it is a this different uh, man. This different here, whereby all all the sportsmen are at home. Uh -huh. uh, it's only for for only one reason. Mm -hmm. That's uh, because of the uh, uh, COVID nineteen. So it's a it's, it's a different life. Mm -hmm. And camps camps are closed. We have seen you training alone. How is it like training alone as opposed to your comrades? Because you guys are really tight. You know what is the difference right now? Uh, it's really a big, big difference. Uh, you know, uh, uh, I value teamwork, and you know, teamwork is what makes somebody to to rise above everything. And mm -hmm. you know, to go out in the morning alone, just running alone, and uh, 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 on the road, it's really difficult, and and, and it's hard. But uh, what can we do? We need to respect the directives from the government and yes. uh, and all the organization in order to beat uh, uh, this pandemic thing. Mm -hmm. And London Marathon and the Olympics were the races you had scheduled to run this particular year, but they are all postponed. You know, after everything resumes to normal, which particular races will we see you take part in? Um, I will really run one of the races in the fall, but uh, uh, I think the uh, negotiation is still going on. But my uh, uh, number one priority now is, uh, is safety, and that's why I'm at home. I'm really keeping safe, keeping my family safe, uh -huh. and encouraging people actually to be at their homes, you know, that for, for the whole world to be safe. Mm -hmm. And yeah. the Olympics will be taking place just a few months uh, before your 37th birthday. Will the, uh, this uh, 2021 Olympics be your last Olympics, or will we see you in action in the 2024 uh, Games in Paris? Uh, you know, that's next year is 2021, and uh, uh, I don't want to, to actually preempt what will happen after 2021, <laughs> but all in all is that uh, you will still see me around. I'm uh -huh. still around, and, 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 but uh, as the time goes, uh, uh, anything might change, but I'm still around. Uh -huh. uh, that is great yeah. to hear. So kindly, on a lighter note, tell us, what are some of the talents you have discovered about yourself during this time you have been home with your wife and kids? Some of the interesting things you have known about yourself. I'm, 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 I'm a good cooker. I'm trying to cook and I know <laughs> what are the, the skills of cooking. So I've discovered that I can cook something sweet. <laughs> ah, okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what else apart from cooking? <laughs> I think cook, I think cooking is my favorite uh, <laughs> for the last one week. <laughs> <laughs> and what meal in particular? Is it just ugali, ama murzik, kukaroga kabisa? What meal in particular? Uh, making ugali at the same time, making a choice for the kids. and, and uh -huh. I, I think those are the two ones where I, 
Hi, I am specializing on it. <laughs> uh, that is amazing because I know before the coronavirus ends, they will definitely have a lot to say about their father. <laughs> and also, um, we saw you taking photos uh, recently. What was that particular photo shoot about and why was that particular uh, theme chosen for your GQ uh, feature? Uh, GQ is a big magazine in Pestie, New York, and mm -hmm. it's actually a, 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 yeah. every month, it's a, most of the celebrities either in sport or in music are being featured. Uh -huh. So I was lucky actually to be contacted uh, by GQ, uh -huh. take a photo shoot, and we have most of the fashion clothes. And I am proud uh, to, be for, to be in the, actually in, in GQ newspaper uh, uh -huh. for April. <laughs> and looking at those prizes, I'm sure most Kenyans would really love to come to your wardrobe right now, you know, and just <laughs> pick some of the items. <laughs> so, what are some of uh, just your final words to Kenyans during this particular difficult time and also to other athletes? Because I know for global sport, all the athletes, you know, it hasn't been easy. Your final words. Uh, my final words to my fellow Kenyans is that... Uh, 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 all of us who are in danger of uh, uh, in, uh, getting this disease, coronavirus. Mm -hmm. But the good news is that uh, all of us, we have a solution mm -hmm. to this uh, uh, pandemic. Mm -hmm. And the solution is to stay at home, mm -hmm. uh, wash, our, wash your hands uh, regularly, use uh, and sanitize as well necessary, avoid the necessary movement. Uh, and, and those are the solutions. To my fellow athletes, please, please, please train in isolation and and actually keep, uh, keep uh, the government directives and all the people. Perfect. Thank you very much. That was Eliud Kipchoge, the greatest of all time marathoners. Out of 13 marathons he has taken part in, he has won 12. Thank you very much, Eliud Kipchoge. We as K24 and the Sports Desk are truly honored you know, to have you on board.